and today episode it's about uh, my Polaris uh, you can see it fell again the ball joint right on the side you know when you buy Polaris you go to the forest there's a 50 50 chance you're gonna come back maybe you don't and uh, make sure if you go to the forest you gotta go with the team of two and uh, the other person make sure you drive some Yamaha or Honda not Kawasaki it's just Yamaha and Honda pretty reliable so they can pull you home and even if you come with your own tools you still you won't come back because that kind of crappy can happen so uh, today episode it's a ball joint uh, we're gonna replace both of them the left and the right side this is some Chinese uh, ball joint and uh, made in China and it's, it's from China this is from eBay uh, that's a part number this is Pol the Polaris is uh, 2000, uh, 1999 Polaris Crumbler 500 and yep this is it so just gonna work on this crop right now first I recommend to take the wheels off uh, it save you time and effort so we're just gonna do that now get this on So yeah, this is it. First, we're gonna remove that uh, and uh, bracket. And this is 532 alien key. So just gonna take this plate off from one side. Oh, and of course, it's tread lock it. I don't wanna it's a little bit beat up. Yeah. Yeah, so we're just gonna put the one quarter and slowly oops and we can remove. But before that it just basically just wibble wobble so we can take the bead off. Yeah. So now it's ready. Right, let's see. See if we can be able to move this around. So First, you gotta take those security you can won't affect anything then uh, it's exactly 916.
Oh, does it want to go? Or on the... Just have to push this one here and then... That's it. And... So now, it's gonna take this off. Just have to make sure you got the right one. Put in and Yeah, the size is uh, 532 over here, the Allen key. Make sure you get night fit well before you start spinning. Because otherwise you can screw up that bolt. Then small hammer. Come out. Doesn't want to go either. Mm. Almost straight, but it's not important. Let's do this one now. So, yeah, raining outside. Perfect weather for welding. And I gotta put the uh, any close up GoPro because I've screwed up already my glass. And the good things GoPro has those uh, replacement lenses. I mean, other lenses, the, the glass on the front. It's a good thing. Yeah, it's gonna weld this a little bit more around to just seal this perfectly and this one as well and we'll see we'll see what, how it's gonna work out okay so this could be done two ways one way re-grease oh we still have now one point missing but let's see the other side if this one we have the same issue yeah we got the same issue okay so let's do the weld again and fix the leak there's one right there and that one is over here so
going to set up this a little bit higher. Okay, second attempt. A little bit bigger bolts. And uh, see if it's going. See if it helps. There's nothing else. Nothing right now helping. Maybe that's it. Dealing with this. After wondering, we come up with the idea to sacrifice this bolt, well done, and use like that, handy dandy, see if it works. It's working. She's out. It's from here. Yeah. <laughs> Fits right on there. All right, this is the other side. We did the same thing, process, sacrifice, no, reuse it, sacrifice piece. And 36 millimeter bolt, uh, some uh, spacer. spacer, yeah. And bolty, bolty. Just gonna wait a little bit to cool down. Get those kachunk, kachunk. Yeah, it's coming. Just 
gonna show everybody uh, it's pulling out no problem and it's out <laughs>